that matters. This is CBS 17 News. The COVID-19 pandemic dealing another big blow to the airline industry. Yeah, that's right. Two major carriers will start furloughing employees today. This could impact more than 30,000 people. CBS 17's Jamise Price is live at RDU with the impacts. Jamise. Yeah, we're starting to see more folks flying out. Just take a look here at RDU. At one point, this place was empty, but we're starting to see more passengers come in. But still, that's not enough for some airlines to sustain. United and American Airlines will start layoffs today, and flight attendants will take the brunt of those cuts. This comes after congressional leaders and the Trump administration failed to reach a deal on a coronavirus relief package. The funding in the relief package was meant to help Help airlines deal with a major decline in bookings until the market could really bounce back. Now, the airlines and their labor unions, they lobby for another $25 billion in taxpayers' dollars to pay workers for six more months through March. Now, they've already received $25 billion in payroll help, but that money and a related ban on furloughs expected to end today. And uh, U.S. travel, you know, it dropped by 95 percent back in April, and that was a few weeks after that first significant corona virus outbreak here in the U.S. Now, uh, passenger traffic has recovered slightly. We've seen it here at RDU, but it still remains down by 70 percent from a year ago, and uh, carriers just are not um, having that many people book flights, and that's keeping some of those planes grounded, and that's all why we're starting to see these layoffs, and we're talking thousands, thousands of folks will be laid off today. Live at RDU, Jamise Price, CBS 17 News.